Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So they added the Gold Jackals and they added Snowshoe Hair. And I'm not going to lie, the freaking Snowshoe Hair are difficult to find. Um, I just had two running around out here. And wouldn't you know it, by the time I get set up to... Oh, no, hit record. I was going to say they're gone, but no, there they are right there. Um, so, yeah, these guys are really hard to hunt. The, the hares in Transylvania are much easier to find. Um, these little guys, though, they are really difficult. So we're going to try to take one out to take a look at it here. We have a one-star young male and a female. If he stops, I think we'll take a shot out on him. So we're going to try to get one of these and then we'll uh, look at them in the encyclopedia. Do you ever stop, dude? Oh, did we, did we get him? <sighs> I don't know if we got him. I thought I saw blood. So, the European hares, they, uh, they stop <laughs> more frequently than these. Uh, these ones, they seem to just be in kind of a perpetual motion. Hmm. I don't know where she went either. Say though, I, I've only seen her, so I'm going to assume that we got him. But the one thing that we know about these is that it, they have the same exact zones as the European hare. So that's the one thing that I really like about this game. Um, no matter what the animal, if there's a species that's similar to it, they all have the, the same time zone. So... Rabbits, they have the same time zones. The predators, they all have the same same time zones. Uh, I believe for the most part. Um, so that that's good. But the problem is, <laughs> they don't all have the same habitats. Okay, so this is a need zone, and it's an often used one. So that's that's good. That's gonna at least help the video. Oh, she was right there. Oh, wait, is that him? Oh, God, I didn't get him. Okay. So, we're going to have to let them settle down. <laughs> and... Uh, I guess, try it again. God, there we go. We got it that time. Holy. That uh, that shouldn't have been that difficult. But we finally got one down so I can at least show you guys. I'm really glad that these aren't a species that I'll spend too much time on. There it is. There's our little snowshoe hair. So let's pick up and see which one we got here. Uh, did we get the male? No, we got the female, of, of course. So full hunt rating. Of course, we got it with the 22. Um, wow, we shot really high on that, huh? Okay, let's go to the overview and let's click inspect. Zoom that out a little bit. Let's hide that. So there it is, guys. That's that's the snowshoe hair. Um, I don't know what I think. Uh, I think they look good. I don't know. The face and the head maybe look a little off to me. But uh, overall, I think it's pretty good. Again, with this game, you know, the uh, the, the small species, the, the small game, not the most exciting thing. Uh, look at that that animation of it breathing. That's that's very cool. And, I mean, if you zoom in, the fur texture looks really nice. All right, so 
that's the snowshoe hair. Let's let's sell that off, and then let's take a look now in the encyclopedia for these guys. Okay, snowshoe hair, also called the varying hair, is a species of hair found in North America. It has the name snowshoe because of the large size of its hind feet, which prevent it from sinking into the snow when it hops and walks. It has fur on the soles of its feet to protect them from freezing temperatures. These animals are nimble and fast. They need to be, as they are a popular target for many predators. Hunting tier 1 recommended hit energy, 56 to 628 joules. So they feed from 12 a.m. to 3 a.m. And then from 3 a.m. to 4 a.m. they're sleeping. And then from, uh, I, I apologize, 3 a.m. to 9 a.m. they're sleeping. And then from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. they're eating again. And then they go back to sleeping. They don't drink at all, which is strange because I'm pretty sure rabbits drink. But okay. So the, uh, the weights go from 2.2 pounds all the way up to 3 3.42 on a male. Female's actually bigger. That's interesting. That is interesting. So, you would think, because of their, their size, that maybe a female should have a star rating. But that's not how this game works. All right, so body variations. Hares are slightly larger than rabbits, and they typically have longer hind legs and ears. Snowshoe hares have especially large furry feet that help them to move. Younger hares are distinguished by their ears, which are bigger relative to the head size than older individuals. Their primary habitat is the highland forest. That's very important. Trophy type is weight. And again, 500 is the, uh, the max, and 485 is a five-star. With these guys. So is that the same as the European hair? 458 makes a five star on the European hair. Interesting. Interesting. But that's the snowshoe hair, guys. So now I'm going to go over to Transylvania and we're going to try to find the, uh, the golden jackals. But first, the two objectives. So we got two new objectives on this map. I want to say, yeah, we have Hare's Dynamite, where you need to collect 59.52 pounds of snowshoe hair meat. That is going to be incredibly difficult. Then we have Soup for the Soul and the Marriage. We need to harvest 10 mature snowshoe hares. Again, that's going to be difficult, especially considering that it seems like when they add a new animal to any existing map, you don't have any matures. They're, they're all young, and they, they have to grow. Good news is these aren't like bear. They're, they're not going to take years and years to grow, so it shouldn't be too difficult. All right, guys, now I'm going to head over to the Transylvania map, and we're going to try to figure out where to find them. I will say the uh, the missions, the camps that you found the missions on, they were both in the Highland Forest area, so I'm assuming wherever you find the missions, that's going to be the areas that you can hunt for said species. All right, guys, so now we are on the Transylvania map, so we are going to be looking for the Golden Jackal, and if we... Whoa. Whoa. What is going on? Where did these guys come from? Star adult, nothing, nothing decent in this herd. Wow. Okay. So that was that was strange. So let's take a look at the map. So we have a new mission here, and this is in the grasslands. And we have a new mission up here. Which, this is in the Highland Forest. Now, here's the thing. I thought they said that they added some brown bear missions as well. We have a question mark over here. So, 
I mean, I don't have all of the campsites on this map. I still don't have this this whole map uncovered. So let's uh, let's take a look and see what this mission is for here. Okay, we received reports that number of golden jackal populations. Okay, so this is a golden jackal mission. So that means the golden jackal should be in the grasslands, but. We are going to fast travel up here and see what this mission is as well. All right, so here we are up in the Highland Forest area. And you guys know this is one of my favorite spots for red deer. Um, I don't know what weapon we're going to need for these either. So I'm going to check this out and then we'll go back to the lodge, um, trade out some guns, and then go back to the grassland. So where's this from? Uh, three things in life never stop exciting me. The sight of late summer sunrise, the smell of deep woods, and the sounds bears make. Yes, you heard me right. The grunts, the growls, the moans, they have it all. What a palette. Okay, so this is a bear mission. Even if the bear doesn't make any sounds, it's okay. As long as you happen to hunt for it very early. So let's, uh, let's go into the objectives and see what these are asking for us. Um... Harvest an adult bear between 4 a.m. and 7 a.m. Okay. Harvest one golden jackal with a one-star rating. Harvest one golden jackal with a five-star trophy rating. Wow. Okay, so these missions, man, these are these are legit. These are not going to be easy. So I know nothing about the golden jackals. I'm going to go back. I'm going to get um, a different loadout for what I think may help. And, uh, yeah, hopefully when we come back, we'll at least spot a golden jackal to, uh, to show off here on camera. All right, guys. So I have been playing for probably three or four hours on this map, and I cannot find a single golden jackal. We have a nice herd of red deer over there. I don't have a gun to take one of them down. All I have with me is the... 270, I think, and the 243. There's a nice four star in there. I wouldn't mind taking out one of those two stars just to ensure the herd quality. Where is that four star? Is that him right there? Yeah, that's him right there. He is a good looking stag. But. In all this time, I have only found two need zones for these damn things. I've never seen a golden jackal. I've never heard them. I'm... I don't know. I'm starting to think that they're not even on the map. I cannot find a trace of them other than two drink zones, which I have this one here and that one there. And I am in drink time. And they aren't at either one of them. And I was at this spot at the uh, the late drink time, and they weren't here then either. And this is supposed to be one of the ones that they're they're drinking frequently. So I don't know. Um, all I can say is if anybody out there that's on console has seen one of these jackals on their map or they, they've killed it, let me know in the comments because honestly, I, I'm... I don't know. I have no idea. And if I'm being 100% honest with you guys, I am just really glad that this isn't going to be a species that I'll, I'll regularly hunt because trying to find these little things is just crazy. I mean, what do we got here now? I, I don't find prints. I don't find tracks. I don't find droppings. I haven't heard them. You know, it's just, I don't understand. I have no idea where the hell they could be. Like I said, in the beginning, I thought that they would be around where we found the mission. Um, oh, we got wolves here. What do we got here for gray wolves? Two-star mature. Wow. Okay, we got two-star mature. Yeah, I... <laughs> I have no idea. I looked it up even on Google to find out where these things live in real life. And it said arid grasslands. So I thought for sure they would be in the grassland areas. 
But no, no, they're, they're not. Um, I found a map on Discord that's supposed to show you where all of their their drink zones are and all of their need zones, and not on that's not true for console anyway. Um, so I have no idea where the hell these golden jackals are, but uh, yeah, I, I can't find them. But I think I am going to take one of these wolves out if I can here, just for good measure. Ah, and I gotta load it. Come on, really? 212. Oh! <laughs> wow, so... Yeah, okay. Wait a minute. <laughs> Let me just, uh... Drop a marker there. So, if you guys have watched the uh, the past videos on my channel, you'll know that I'm not really great at taking a moving shot on wolves. So, that really shocked me that, that we dropped it. But you know what? I'm going to pick this guy up, and we're still going to take a look at these jackals because we can do that. Um, and yeah, like, for real, guys, seriously, if, if you're on a console and you have seen... <laughs> Uh, these jackals on your map or maybe you've actually managed to kill one, please let me know because I'm really starting to think that they forgot to put them on the map. I mean, the snowshoe hares on Nespers Valley, they were kind of a pain in the ass to find. Um, again, I found need zones before I found the actual rabbits, but we did find them. Here, I cannot find them. I have no idea where they could be. Like I said, I found two other need zones. I tried to go back to those need zones at the times. I don't hear them calling. I just, it just seems like they're not on the map. It's like when the uh, the brown bear were on, were not on the map yet. If you remember that, we had the need zones, but the uh, the bears actually weren't on the map. It kind of feels like that same thing. But anyway, let's uh, let's pick up our gray wolf here. I wonder if I even shot the right one. You know, one other thing. I, I hope I don't think the devs will ever watch this. I may put it in their Discord. So, I would love to get this, but th the shot camera, you know what I mean? So, I don't want to see the x-ray. I want to switch this around so you get the, the full look of the animal of when you shot it, but not, not with the x-ray. So, in other words, like, I want this view here, but I want it in the pose of when we actually shot it. That's uh, that's what I would love to see them do in the game because this would help me out so much with thumbnails if they did that where I could have the actual pose when I shot it. That would be really awesome. But anyway, thinking of that, okay, this was the two-star mature. Very cool. Okay, so we will sell him. And if we go into the encyclopedia, oops, and scroll on over to animals, we can see here finally that the Golden Jackal, because we did pick up a need zone, we don't have a lot of information on them. They are a Tier 4 animal like the Road Deer, and as of right now, there's only one Tier 4 weapon in the game, and I believe that's the uh, the 30-30 that your grandfather had. So uh, they really need to they need to give us another Tier 4 weapon. You know, so devs, again, if you're, if you're watching this, you know, we need another Tier 4 weapon. We have two Tier 4 animals, and we have a gun that's all right, but not... Not the best for long-distance shots. So, the Golden Jackal occurs in North and East Africa, Southeastern Europe, and South Asia to Burma. Golden Jackals prefer dry, open country and arid, short grasslands. See, that's what I mean. And I, guys, I was hunting in the grassland area for so long, and all I could see was fox. I didn't get any need zones at all for these things over there. So, I just, I really don't know. So you can see here, that's how we have unlocked. Matures, they go 9 to 12 years old. Um, 24 to 33 pounds on the male, 20 to 24 pounds on the female. Again, all their, uh, their life cycle, all their zones, it's the same as all the other predators. And they look like this. Kind of, uh, kind of an interesting looking little creature. I mean, kind of resembles a coyote in a way, right? That's... Uh, that's kind of what I thought when I first 
seen it here. It looks a lot like a coyote. But those are the two new species, guys. Again, I apologize so much for not being able to show you this thing on the map. I really tried. I have no idea where the hell this is. If uh, if I find them, I'll definitely let you guys know about it. But, uh, yeah, for right now, I do kind of feel like they're not in the game. I'm probably wrong. They probably are. Maybe they're just really elusive. That could be, you know, the bear or, or similar to that. But, uh, yeah, I've been playing this, like, all day, and I couldn't find one of these things. So that's where we're going to end the video today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I hope you're having a better luck finding these things than I am. Like I said, if you're on a console and you have seen them on your map, please let me know. I'd really appreciate that. If you did like the video, you guys know what to do, right? And if you're not already subscribed, then what are you doing? Because I look at my analytics all the time, guys, and I see that the majority of my viewers aren't even subscribed. So if you're watching the videos anyway, you might as well subscribe. We are over 2 thousand subscribers now i think the last time i checked we're like 2025 it is amazing i thank you all so much i appreciate all of you so much like i said for those of you that aren't subscribed you might as well subscribe if you're watching the videos anyway so as always guys i hope you're having a fantastic day we'll see you next time until we do happy hunting